At first glance with this matrix, you may be tempted to look for rotational patterns, but the two patterns that are the most important are the shading of the circles and the orientation of those circles. And we can find those patterns in the diagonals of this matrix, in our 159 and in our 249. In our 159 diagonal, we can see that the shading pattern is the same. Shade 1, skip 1, shade 2. Shade 1, skip 1, shade 2. In our 249 pattern, we can see that the orientation of the circles is this sideways L. Let's visualize this in a bit of a neater way. So here's our 159 pattern. And as we can see, the shading pattern is the same. In this diagonal, we're shading two side by side. In this diagonal, we're shading three side by side. So our missing element should match this diagonal, our 159, where it's one, skip one, shade two, which would eliminate us down to answer choice E and F. So now let's take a look at our 249 diagonal and see that everything in the uh, farthest diagonal is an upside down L, everything in this middle diagonal is a backwards L, and then the row with our mystery element, all of these are a sideways L, which will narrow us down to answer choice E.